Yeah, man, it's, uh, it's definitely really different. No doubt about it. Uh, I was, I was kind of standing out there. I was like, we're not going good, man. But no, uh, Keaton's a great guy. He actually had a, a really good day today. Uh, I was really, I was really proud of him. He's a, uh, he's worked really hard since he got here, and he's, he's actually picked up on a lot of things. So it, it, it's really good to see. What's it like walking into this one as, as the guy? Now you are the returning starting quarterback as compared to the last couple of years. Oh, uh, it's different. It's definitely different. You know, uh, being, being, you know, kind of. The guy's going to be the starter. You know, it's, it's more you have to push yourself to be the best that you can be, and, and no one else is really pushing you like they were last year. It's, it's more just you working on your own things and, and tweaking your own stuff on your own. What's it been like being with Coach Elliott again? What's that relationship like? Uh, it's awesome. I actually called him Uncle Rico. Nice <laughs> little, nice little inside joke there. But uh, <laughs> so uh, breaking bad. Uh, from uh, Napoleon, Napoleon Dynamite, Dynamite, actually. Uh, yeah. So uh, it, it's been good having him back. He was uh, he was actually one of the first guys I talked to. Even on campus when I came here and took my visits, he uh, he put me through like an hour long workout. Uh, at one point here, it's just like always had a good bond. I was always really close. You know, always kept in contact even when he left. So it's uh, it's awesome to have him back. You mentioned Keaton had a good day. Thanks. What kind of questions is he asking you? What, what is he turning to you for for anything? And, and just you know, you mentioned he had a good day. What kind of things did he do? Out there? I mean, you know, kind of just the, the normal stuff. You know, just help with protections, help, help with the plays, kind of stuff. You know, uh, I think he kind of ran this this kind of thing in high school. So. Uh, it kind of clicked for him way faster than it did for me, which is which is awesome for him. I'm glad. Uh, he he's just doing a phenomenal job. To be honest with you, I was I was really really surprised. Really really glad. Now that you've started games last year and I've played through a year. What's it like going into the spring knowing what you're preparing for in the fall? Uh, I mean it's it's good knowing exactly you know what what I'm going to be going up against, what I'm going to be expecting, uh, and knowing the things that I need to work on the most, and knowing the little things that I need to tweak. From, from going back and watching games in, in the past in the last season, uh, it's just great being out there, to be honest with you. What are your goals for the spring? Uh, just work on my footwork in the, in the pocket and, and uh, just kind of get my completion rating up and, and uh, just not being so, I guess, jittery in the pocket. With Jamal and now Jaquel gone, you're breaking in a new center, and a couple of those guys are hurt, so I guess it's Martinez and Harrison right now at center. How are you helping develop the center position too? Because that's pretty important to your job. Oh no, no doubt. Uh, they they actually work really hard this offseason too. Uh, we they were out there getting snaps every day, uh, working, watching a lot of films, so working on their on their reads and their calls, and uh, they did a really good job today. Uh, you know, a few bad snaps, but that's okay. You know, that's how a few bad throws. It's the first day. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. We'll work on it, and uh, they're just gonna keep improving. So we'll see what happens. How do you feel about the wide receivers group that coming into this spring? Phenomenal. Awesome. We what lost, makes you say that? We lost one guy. I mean, we have everyone else coming back. You know, we have some young guys that uh, that got a lot of reps last year. They're gonna move into more, you know, uh, le uh, leadership roles and more, you know, kind of starting jobs and then that starting rotation. So uh, I feel really good about them. And having to and having to push yourself this year. How often do you kind of, if at all, reflect on the fact that hey, you know, a couple of years ago I, I wasn't, you know, that you know four star, five star quarterback and. How how often do you have to reflect on that maybe to motivate yourself? Uh, you know, I think you know, I kind of I kind of moved off from that. You know, there's always going to be a chip on my shoulder. You know, that not really many other people wanted me, and that that's always going to be something that drives me. But I think that's that's more kind of the back of my mind. I don't really think about it like that. I, I just think about you know, you're here. Uh, obviously, you're here for a reason, and, and you're in the position you are for a reason. So uh, work your butt off, be the best you can be for your teammates, and just keep pushing everyone else around you. Having proven yourself last year and kind of won the huddle. You know, as the season went on, do you feel like it's really more your team this year? Uh, you know, I think as a starting quarterback, I think I guess it, it would be you know kind of your team. You know, you have the you have the respect and, and the trust from all the other players. So, uh, in, in a way, yes. But I mean, also in a way, you know, there are plenty of other guys on this team that are leaders and, and have taken up leadership roles. And I think it's kind of just all of our team. You talk about how you only lost one receiver last year. What does that do for you? Knowing that you are comfortable with all the receivers, uh, it's amazing. You know, we we worked all last year on timing with all of them, so it's it's the same thing. On uh, the off season, we kept working you know, through an hour and a half a day after after everything we did, we we throw and make sure that we were we were going to be ready for this uh, for these practices. So uh, it's it's been great, you know, having that chemistry already built just to keep it building on it. Nick, that hasn't been that long since the season ended, but you know, start of a new season. How good does it feel to be? Out there playing again. Oh man, it's amazing. Uh, I'll definitely take practicing over over workouts at 5 a.m. any day. So.